gonna leave that for Keemstar, but hey, welcome back to another brand new video guys. This is Deck Alpha, back at it with another brand new video. Now I don't usually do these type of videos, but hey, there's a trend going on, so I decided why not hop onto it. Anyways, so as the title says, Marquez Brownlee, also known as MKBHD, decided to go on Twitter and tweet this out against the Paul brothers. And he had to say this. Now seems like a good time to remind the world that YouTubers like the Paul brothers do not represent the entire community. That is all. Now this tweet got about 50,000 likes and about 7,000 retweets. There was a lot of interaction going on with this tweet. However, I noticed that whenever a lot of news channels like Keemstar, Scares and whatever, when they talked about other celebrities or YouTubers talking against Logan Paul or the situation, no one really brought up Marquez's tweet. Now, I don't really know why, maybe because he's a tech YouTuber and they realize he's kind of irrelevant into the entertainment industry, which I don't really agree with because I think he, being a big YouTuber, a massive YouTuber with over 5 million subscribers, deserves to be put out there on the news because he too is a big role and a big face of YouTube. In fact, he's been on YouTube Rewind for a long time now and YouTube really likes him. Forbes even mentioned him as a top influencer so he clearly has a good following and a good reputation so i was really just curious why no one really brought up his tweet because i think he made a really good claim here youtube has a huge audience and the biggest demographic is little kids so a lot of adults when they hear the word youtube they think oh my kid watches jake paul watches logan paul but hey i think marquez had a really good tweet i mean it it really does make sense the paul brothers do not represent the whole YouTube community, all right? Just because they do stupid things doesn't mean that the whole YouTube community is like that. And yeah, I just don't want to drag on the video. It's just a really small tweet. I just wanted to throw it out on the internet because I feel like why isn't it not getting attraction or why is no one really talking about it? It's such a great tweet. And a lot of people reply to this tweet saying stuff like, you are a much better example of a good YouTuber in the community and I think Google really likes you too. So a lot of people are saying, hey, you're the best person to be talking about this because I see a lot of bad YouTubers are talking against Logan Paul. I'm not going to call out any names, but they too do really stupid stuff. And when I see them talking against Logan Paul's stupid stuff, which is very, very disturbing, it's like, hey, he's doing a lot of bad stuff, but you're kind of doing similar activities too. So yeah, but Marquez Brownlee, being the great guy he is, has nothing wrong nothing wrong in his plate so when he talks against a really bad youtuber like logan paul it just really really shows that everyone sees this through and a lot of people talked about him like aaron Cavus, everyone but this i think is a strong tweet from a really good face of youtube tech youtubers should be one of the best faces of youtube because they do literally no drama no bs stuff they're on with their content they make good content they're they're just about the content. They're, they're not about, oh, let me just create some drama to like, you know, get some subscribers and all like that. So that's why, yeah. Anyways, I'm talking way too much ranting at this point. So with that being said, this is Tech Alpha signing out with today's video. I just decided to do a little bit of a different video today. But don't worry, tomorrow I'm going to give you guys a full video, a better one with a lot of content. Not not trying to be a new supporter here, alright? Not trying to be Keemstar. But Keemstar, love you. And Marcus Romney, love you a lot. Let's go guys, peace out.